Previously on Skyrim. It's almost the spooky month. Warning. The following game is rated mature and contains content not suitable for younger viewers. Viewer discretion is advised. Hello everyone and welcome back to Skyrim. On the last episode, we headed over to Falkreath, uh, where we'd started dealing with uh, friendly neighborhood stuff there. Uh, like like we did in Whiterun, a bunch of people in Falkreath had some missions for us to do. We uh, talked with Dengear, the old Jarl, who was like, Hey, steal this letter from my best friend, because I think he's a spy. Uh, we read the letter, and he wasn't a spy, he just wanted some extra armor, or extra materials to make armor and stuff. But Dengear's like, yeah, he's probably making for the Empire. Hey, can you go kill my vampire ancestor? And we were like, uh, uh, sure. <laughs> Haven't done that part yet. We ran into an old warrior who was like, I recently cremated my old friend. He was he was dead before. Uh, can you bring his ashes to the Hall of the Dead and give it to the guy there? Because we want to put it to rest. Did that. Then the guy was like, hey, can you get my journal from a dungeon? Which we'll, we'll deal with later. But there was also uh, the Jarl who wanted us to kill some bandits that we can become the Thane. We headed over to Knife Point Ridge because we had that quest to go kill the bandit leaders there. Turns out there was another quest that led us over to Knife Point Ridge. There was a Khajiit that had uncovered a body thanks to the uh, Crimson Dirks book that we had read back in in uh, Whiterun in the, in the Dragon's Reese dungeon. Uh, he had uncovered a, a grave but had died because I guess the person inside was still alive and escaped with a set of Daedric plate armor which is like one of the most powerful sets of armor in the game. <laughs> and he just happened to be at Knife Point Ridge, so we have the armor now because we took care of that guy. Uh, but we did head inside, took care of the chief. Turns out, not the mission that the Jarl wanted. <laughs> it was the one that the steward wanted. So this episode, we're going to be taking care of that and actually becoming Thane of Falkyrie so that we can, you know, get, get, get away with some crime here. Is that a, is that a tent? That's a tent, huh? As uh, I'm right above Falkry, Falkry is right there, uh, but I didn't want to teleport here or fast travel here because I was. I think there's like a world event that happens in that spot, and I'm pretty sure that keeps on spawning the stupid dragon. <laughs> so I just, I just teleported into the cave I have over here, and uh, yeah, no dragon attack. So eh? I'm curious as what's inside this tent now. I've also, since last episode, starting to try and get my spreadsheet up to date with Creation Club stuff, and you don't know how annoying it is. <laughs> like, for instance, I, even though I, I keep on saying it, we're trying to get most of the books, just because why not? And uh, I look up the Creation Club. Oh, look at this. Hunter's Journal? Yes, please. I really should be reading these books, but whatever. Hey, my sneak increased. Potion, da, da, da. another book. Copper Onyx, sweet. Cool, <laughs> free stuff. So yeah, I've been I've been having to like go through individual Skyrim wiki pages just to find out how many books there are. <laughs> I mean, here's the thing: Skyrim had Dawn Guard, it had Heartfire, it had. Uh, Dragonborn as official DLCs. It had this special edition, which we're playing right now. And it had the anniversary edition, which unlocked the Creation Club things. There was like over 70 Creation Club things. so And most of them gave, actually all of them gave new things. Like, I mean, we're dealing with a lot of these armor quests. And one of them just so happens to be in the correct spot that the the uh, Jarl want, wants us to go. I did look it up. Uh, he wants us to go to Ember Shard. He wants he wants this one. I I I went back in the footage and looked when I, when we uh, we had talked to him and he was like, "Hey, I I have some dealings with the thing." This popped up first though. Before we head there, we're gonna head back over to White Run quickly because there's a mission that leads us to Ember Shard. Okay, so. This is going to deal with more. There's there's two quests left in the Creation Club stuff that we can find in Whiterun, I guess. Well, one of them's in here. The other one, despite being set, despite saying it's in Whiterun, is at Falkreath. 
I don't know. I don't I don't get it. Let's just go inside the guard barracks area. There should be a book in here. Hey. I can't wait to kill another of Ulfric's boys. I think your baked potatoes are alive. Guard Zossier, Yak to Gra Orklug. I'm just gonna crouch and read that. Doesn't say steal. Status active. Capture or kill. High priority. Description female orc, late 40s. Yaktu Gra Orklug was a former blacksmith of the Stash and Slash in the Imperial City. Sop she inherited from her father. She was contacted by the Crimson Dirks and recruited to forge arms for the bandits as well as launder sacked goods through her shop. An Imperial City guard issued a warrant for arrest. She fled the city with another member of the bandit gang. Operational notes. Yaktu was originally thought to have fled to High Rock and taken refuge in an orc stronghold. However, according to our informant, she actually traveled with another agent to Skyrim. Reports are unusually well-made weapons and armor being peddled out of Embershard Mine may be related. This information should be forwarded to Commander Caius in Whiterun as, mine, as the mine falls under his jurisdiction. I'll take that book. Yes, we're going to be dealing with this quest. So this is going to be another armor quest. Like, we got... I mean... I'm wearing the Daedric armor because I, it might, I'd be a fool if I didn't. It's so good. My my my, my armor rating is at 200 plus, and it'll only get better as I uh, upgrade it and get hit by stuff. The goal, <laughs> the goal with some armor, I mean, we're gonna be making our own OP armor later on in the game, but. For now, though, this this should last us a decent long time. Hey, Rasad, I'm gonna talk to you. I have traveled. Take a look. All right, this should respond your chest. May your road lead you to warm All right, that's good. It'll respond his chest, so I think his chest, his merchant chest, is the one that's in solitude. I think there's there's the, there's the three merchant groups. The one that the one the chest in Dawnstar. The chest outside of Markarth and the chest outside of Solitude. Uh, let's quickly teleport over to Riverwood. Actually, let's go to the Guardian Zones because it's closer. This might get us level 20. In which case, there's there's going to be a new set of missions that start unlocking. We're going to be unlocking missions until level 30, I think. There's one mission I know that we unlock at level 30. That's why we can't get all of the Daedric Quest stuff done yet. In fact, I'm talking about a Daedric Quest that unlocks at level 20. We'll probably get a letter from a courier. I did shoot the guy that was standing outside way back when, like in episode 5? <laughs> I don't remember when I, when I murked this guy. Hey there, friend. Goodbye, friend. Here's where I got my uh here's where I got my axe from. Ooh, silver necklace. Okay. So the bandit leader here is under is uh who the Jarl from Falkreath wants us to kill. But there should also be a blacksmith here that has some very powerful armor. So we need to be very, very careful. tripwire right there the thing that's going to cause stuff to fall would probably be that these are these rocks here a miner there's a bridge right there uh i want some darkness Are you worried someone will wander in here this isn't exactly hidden the orc this again Oh, yeah, someone standing guard out here. Don't forget the rock trap. So if you're worrying, he gets some rest. The ship is coming up, and I don't want it dozing off again like last time. Alright, that's a good thing I extinguished those lights. I, they added torches to my, uh, to my uh, miscellaneous tab. I have three of these. I don't need three. Where's this guard that's guarding? This guy is walking up. There's a lever right there, which will activate this bridge right here.
That might have been the guard. There's that guy. Uh-oh. He's coming towards me. <laughs> Not anymore. I think it's just those three. Ooh, look at all the look at all the good stuff here. The heck is that? I should know what it is, but I might have completely forgotten. Orcish plate armor. Was this the guy? Oh, did you have? Give me your arrows, <laughs> please. Oh, whatever. Ah, this was the skeleton I thought had that letter from the previous dungeon. Tattered journal. They've had me working down here for days now. It's not the time that's getting me, though. It's these tunnels. I've told them countless times now to add extra supports to the weak sections of tunnel. If only we had more of those wooden beams that we reinforce with bronze bottoms. Honestly, if I hear the earth shift one more time above my head, I'll be so stressed I may stop drinking for good. I mean, what's a Nord without his mead? Well, <laughs> you... It might have left you paint. It, it, yeah, whatever. Give me the gold. At least you were kind enough to drop gold next to you, and your friends were kind enough to not take it. Long enough for your body to completely decompose. All right, bedroll, bedroll. What the heck is this giant? Oh, it's just a... I thought that was like a weird spot to mine stuff at. But no, it was just a... I don't think there's anything underwater. Kind of hard for us to, kind of hard for me to see underwater. Oh, glug glug glug. Nope, no secrets under here. That's a rock. <laughs> it's not a boulder. Okay, well, that wasn't the guy. We have two markers in this dungeon still. Right that way. So let's start making our way towards there. We got to lower this bridge first. Get some wine. Get some cabbage. I thought we had a guard posted outside. We did. Your eyes peeled. I don't think we're alone. You check huh? the entrance. I'm going to look over here. He's going backwards. Huh? Hey, I'm not here. Where'd your friend go? Your friend just left you to die. You go that way. I'll go home. Well, I didn't I didn't distinguish any fires here. I'm super not hidden. Where that that guy just ignored everything. He's like, I'm gonna go towards the entrance. Turns around. What a coward. There's a guy way down there. Hey, you never saw me do this. I'm doing pretty good with my ooh big chest. Still haven't run into the person yet. Amber shard mind key. Ooh, there should be a locked door around here then. More orcish plate armor. I mean, it's super expensive, so why not? I think the I think the weight that it's causing me is uh, negated by how expensive it is. It's a shame that my barter skills suck. <laughs> I'd probably get a lot of money from this. Oh, there's another guard right there. Hey, goodbye. Right in the butt. Anything in here? I think it's, I think the only thing in here is some more like. 
places to mine? It's just like a jail cell. I don't even see a place to mine. Looks like there's a fake window here. And then this door with the big chest. Aha! Clairvoyance, it's a shame we already have that in both we've already read it and I think we already have a copy of it on our on our shelves at home. Uh, elven boots. Oh, they're cheap, though. Lots of sacks with potential food. Ooh, dragon's tongue. The only thing I really care about are probably ingredients. Like, if there was a, a sack full of salt pile. Because you don't know how annoying it is to find salt pile. Hey! Hey! hey. Oh, you know, what? might as well take the ones with ingredients too. Apples are fine. We could buy those anywhere. Plus, I think we have like a hundred back home already. <laughs> but the snowberries are my flowers. Take that. You're also wearing orcish plate armor. You have a helmet. I'm running out of I'm running out of weight very quickly. Look at that guy way over there. I'm going to take that. A guy right there. There's a guy over there. And there's a armor thing right here. Do 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 do. I missed. Uh-oh, 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 Spaghetti-o. There's like six people in there. I do I would rather I would rather not deal with them all at the same time. Yeah, I didn't hit anyone, so there's, like, no body to be like, wait, why is that guy dead all of a sudden? But I'm here. I'm still here. I saw the guy walk by. Where are they? Person down there. Someone right there. Way above their heads. <laughs> I can't shoot. Well, how come I took care of all of these people just fine, but now I'm trying to actually get some good shots in, and I'm missing. Who? Haha, <laughs> there goes that guy. Are you coming this way? Or are you checking out the body? Or are you just stuck right there? Oh, they're coming a little closer, a little closer. Hear this. Ooh, that person's named. <laughs> I can't I, I I don't think I'm I don't think I'm equipped to take on both of them right now. I do have my sh I do have my shout. I do have my uh not my unrelenting force, but my berserker rage. Nope. Yes. <laughs> Yambo saying this out loud. Uh, uh. God, look at this person singing. There's corpses around. Oh, there's way more people here than I thought. One, two, three, at least four people are still alive. Is that someone way up there? there? Jesus Christ. Hey, leader's dead. Okay, they're probably going to go towards that last arrow instead. Why was the leader right there? I don't understand. God, I cannot wait to get the sneak ability for my archery where I do three times as damage. Oh, my God. oh that didn't do anything. Damn you. Victory is yours. I submit. Ah! All right. 
Yaktu's journal. Yaktu's key. Gold, blacksmith's apron. We don't need that. I mean, take a copy. Read the journal. Ah, oh, she gave some very good armor to someone, huh? Let's read about this. It's all the way at the bottom. Wait. Yep, I do no clairvoyance. I nearly turned around and went back to Cyrodiil because Bjormund wouldn't shut up. From dawn to dusk, it was Skyrim this and Skyrim that. We hadn't even crossed the mountains yet, and I felt like I'd spent an attorney at the place. But by Malakath, he kept going. He went on all about all the different legends and the hundreds of Ragnars involved in them. The hundreds of Ragnars. He talked for hours about his family and for days about his mead. Sometimes even sang about them. Silence was not an option. Perhaps if they put that on my bounty, I might have been okay with the rest of it. There's a blacksmith. There's one story I didn't get tired of. The one about the Skyforge. It's an ancient relic watched over by a great stone eagle, he said. Come spring, you will be forging weapons under its wings, he said. I ate it up, even though I knew it was a lie. Skyforge was for legendary smiths, and I was a wanted criminal. Unless the guard decided to quit looking for us. I was going to spend my, the rest of my life crafting orcish plate for bandits. Idiots who didn't deserve my work and lacked the brains to value it. But maybe that's what maybe that's what made me mad the most about Bjorman's tales of hearth and home. We weren't going to be welcome in Skyrim or anywhere for that matter. We were crimson dirks. We had a home and now it was gone. Alright, then where's Bjormund? Oh, there's a chest down there. Hey, you're still alive somehow. Can you like stop missing me, please? There we go. It's about darn time. Big money. Is there anyone left in here? It's gonna say cleared because we killed the we killed the bandit chief. But is there anyone left around here? Body down there. Lots of iron. Cool little waterfall chest right there. And uh, down there's the blacksmithing area. With the Hello there, bandit friend. Oh, I hate you. Ooh. Ooh. That was good. Look at this. Weapons. Fire arrows. These are in, like, the, uh... God, what were they in? They were, like, spell... They were in one of the creation club things where you can add a spell to an arrow. So there's fire arrows. There's shock arrows. It's gonna be so helpful when dealing with some of the dragons. Just, just use its weakness. And it'll be very good. Amethyst, garnet, gold. Mine, please. It's going to really suck when I, I'm going to be over encumbered and I can't carry all these orcish plate armors in my hands. <laughs> I mean, I, pop, I, I could do like the old Skyrim trick and put them all in a body and then just carry the body. <laughs> these tomatoes look way better. Oh, maybe it's just the angle. There's like these look way more realistic than every other food in here. Chest booby trapped. Chest booby trapped. It's not. I don't need all these torches. I could probably put them away. Get some get some extra weight out. Gold. The heck happened here? Well, oh, rabbit, rabbit, pheasant, rabbit. Potato, yum, yum. Oh, they're eating rat. Ew. Oh, they're both carrots. I guess this is the kitchen. Oh, there's a, there's a cave that goes back here. <laughs> there's one of the arrows I shot and missed. There should be like three or four more around here. This should lead back to that little ledge out here to this chest lock picking i need to get up we're doing it slowly i don't think I've, i don't think we found anyone that could teach me lock picking yet 
Speaking of which, maybe I should go maybe I should go back to Fangdal and learn a little bit more archery. Okay, can we get down from here? Kind of. Orcus plate armor. Oh, these things are okay. This is the this is the big one. Oh boy, oh boy, I'm super in, over encumbered. Oh look, a book. Book light armor forging. That should raise my smithing. Oh, ooh, I hit level. I'll take that. Hammer, tongs, iron ore, iron ore. All right, great sword. Da -da -da. Oh, you got some iron ingots for me. Thank you. How over encumbered am I? 30? Anything I don't need. I have. So, oh God, I could drop this and immediately go down to 29. I have so much orcish plate armor. What's the cheapest thing? The boots? The boots. How about other miscellaneous things? I have a random shovel. Oh, I accidentally picked that up <laughs> when uh when I had to redo the whole go to knife point rage and kill everyone there. Let me get rid of this plate and this uh, empty wine bottle in this basket. Okay, I'm still over encumbered, but at least I have less things on me. There's another body to go check, so don't be too painful. I could make some more arrows. Just like make a bunch of iron arrows. I do have the uh, I do have some ingots, and I do have... I could go get some firewood right behind me. There's a fishing station here. I can catch some random fish here? I read up, because, you know, I had the time when I was researching all the creation clips stuff I have to add to my spreadsheet. There's so many fishing quests. <laughs> I'm scared how many fishing quests there are. There's like... 15. It's like its own little mini side quest arc. Okay. Uh, hmm. Let's get rid of... Oh, but the boots are going to be the, the... the They're the lightest. Uh, do I have a, carry, a carrying capacity potion? I should be holding on to one. By 20. Oh. Potion of strength. Do I have like a extreme strength? No. Well, I don't need. I guess I could drop. No, give me that armor set back. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Orcs plate. Orcs plate. Where's the... Give me that. Because I could just do... Drink that potion now. Three hundred seconds. That's in-game. So... Let me get the heck out of here. You gotta get up to there. I need to get outside and then fast travel home. I think we're done with any guards here, so I, I'm free to run. As long as I don't accidentally trip another thing. There's a back entrance to this place as well, uh, as indicated by these things. A little harder to find because it's not marked on the map. Uh, get out. Get out. Go. It's going to expire by the time I fast travel. Oh. Oh, it was, it was deserved. I'm so close to home. Would this be faster? Oh, yeah. Definitely faster. I'll take that now. <laughs> now I gotta go upstairs. 
<sighs> I just need to put the enchanted ones away so I can sell the non-enchanted ones. Don't tell me that this armor that I have is block 25 more damage with your shield. Carrying capacity increased by 35 points. What does my uh, boots give me? Brawn. 40. That's better. Ooh, okay, I reached I reached where my apparel goes. You go in there. You, 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 and you. Oh. I, am your sword and your shield. I could have used your help. <laughs> oh, my back. Oh, my back. Wait, did we finish off that quest? We did. Okay, let me level up now. Uh, oh boy. Getting more speech would really help out. So my prices are way better. That's a 32. This is a 31. Sneak is getting close. Light armor. Where's my heavy armor? This one, I can't do that one. That would help us with all the fighting we have to do. I need to be level 40 for that. Smithing can't do anything with that. Enchanting would really help. If my new enchanters are twenty percent stronger, boy, making a whole new set of armor would be way better. But I don't think we're going to be enchanting anything for a while now. Uh, da, 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 da. Arrow stagger. But we are just killing them. 60% more damage. Oh, it's right there. Let's get... Let's work on... Speech. Okay, let's go over to Falkreath. Oh, I'm going to fast travel to Falkreath. Okay. All right. Bad things are going to happen. I'm going to fast travel here. <laughs> I don't want to be accosted by, like, every single guard again. Be like, hey, why are you here? And then we get attacked by a dragon. And it's like, wow, what was my fault? We can see for miles here. No dragon as of yet. Oh boy, that's a fall. <sighs> Is it landing? Oh god, it's landing. Oh, that's not good. Oh, God, it's a blood dragon. I've hit level... Tw I Oh, God, I hit level 20, so now the dragons have upgraded. Where are you at? It's attacking something? It's getting hurt by something. I wish I knew by what. I think it's a fire dragon. So... I like its leaf tail. <laughs> if only I knew what it was attacking. It's attacking something that's not dead yet? I'm attacking it in the back. It doesn't even know I exist. I mean, it probably does. Ooh, we hurt it a lot. Does that mean that we broke its wings? Oh, I sync attacked it. 
Oh. Sweet. What did it fight? Who did it fight? Oh. Uh, uh, oh. Oh. <laughs> It fought a hunter. I'll take all these. I'm sorry. Well, that hunter was dead. More likely than not, these people were kind of sacrificed, or they were really drunk. And then they were like, they like tried to attack these uh, these bears with like no armor and stuff. Oh, there's a poor defenseless fox over there. I think the dragon won in the end. The ultimate predator. Elk? I swear there was a third body. I was, I was looking at the elk. And now there's a giant dragon next to us. Well, I mean, I guess it worked. I never saw what it was fighting. It was an enemy, though. It must have been the bear. One pound. Oh... Yeah, I hit level 20, so the dragons are now more powerful, and I hate that now. <laughs> it, mi it might have been a mistake to hit that level 20 thing right now. Uh, let's get back to town so I can get a courier to attack me. After all the trouble I went to spawn away from town... One still showed up. I guess the area of effect of this world trigger is a lot bigger than just right in front of Falk Reef. Now, don't go... Don't go spawning another dragon. I don't know if the dragons are, like, on a timer or anything, but please no. Please no. Oh, here comes the courier. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Let's see here. There's a new museum opening up in Dawnstar. The owner is asking me to hand out invitations to travelers. Looks like that's it. Got to go. That's the new Daedric quest I was talking about. Okay. We've uh, we've taken care of those bandits. So let's go talk with uh, Sidgear. Oh god, there's so many books in this town. I have no idea where any of them are. Good. Yes. What is it that you want? Kill the leader of Ember Shard. Teach them to stop paying me. Here, you deserve a reward for your service. You know what? I like you. You're not afraid to get your hands dirty. I hereby grant you permission to purchase property in Falkreath Hold. Talk to my steward if you're interested. Is there anything else you need, my Jarl? There is room in my court for a new thane. It's an honorary title, mainly. But there are a few perks someone like you could make use of. However, I could only grant the title to someone who is known throughout my hold. You help my people, and I'll make you my thane. It would be an honor. On your way, then. <laughs> I've already done it! I've helped your people, by the way. Then by my right as Jarl, I name you Thane of Falkreath. Congratulations. I grant you a personal house, Carl, and this weapon from my armory to serve as your badge of office. No weapon. I'll also notify my guards of your new title. Wouldn't want them to think you're part of the common rabble now. Oh, the Blade of Falkreath, I think, just made me over-encumbered. Come and see me again sometime. I might have some use for you. Uh, oh? Uh, oh, there it goes. Just activated now. Uh, uh, my back. The Jarl has appointed me to be your house, Carl. It's an honor to serve you. Follow me. I need your help. Lead on, Thane. My blade is always yours to command. Yes, my Thane. Hey. Do you need something? Can you take some stuff off my back? Of course, Thane. How can I be of service? All right, Raya. Why do you have two pairs of scimitars that are both in your right hand? Uh, here, how about you hold all these dragon bones I got? <sighs> Lead on, my thing. Okay, hey, can I purchase some property now? I'm the steward here. I serve under Jarl Sidgear and Jarl Dengear before him. 
Sid Gear can sometimes act too quickly, but he does listen to Helvert and I. Hey, I'm looking for work. Got any leads? The Jarl has put out a bounty on some bandits. Here, take a look at this decree for details. Sweet. Hey, I'd like to purchase a house, too. There's no house available, but I could sell you a fine piece of land where you could build your own house. Uh, I'll take it. You won't regret it. Here's the title to your steading. Follow the road east from Falkreath, then north at the crossroads. Turn left just past Pine Watch. Hey, bleep bloop. May wisdom forever light your path. Okay, so... Back when Skyrim was released, uh, you could buy you could buy houses in all the towns, except you couldn't buy houses in all the towns. There were some towns that had no property to purchase at all. Hardfire added properties to those places, except they're not houses that you buy; they're houses that you build. So let's go follow her instructions. Nope, sorry, nothing. That's fine. Ray is going to be the house Carl, and she's going to stay in this house once we actually finish it off. So she said it's just past Pine Watch, aka Milk Drinker HQ. It's outside of Falkreath a little bit. The good thing is, with these houses that we build, we can put whatever we want in them. Well, we could put whatever we want in the previous house, but we can at least design specific rooms in this house. Also, I had plenty of cash for it, so might as well. <laughs> I had $11,000. I did get a thousand from the from the Jarl right before uh right before that. Okay, are the bandits here? The bandits are here. You have no long range weapon. Where is this guy? Huh? What the heck are you aiming at? Ooh, I hit him. Seriously, what are they fighting? Hey, my stick is at 50. Hi there. Great, great, great shot. Oh, there goes a, there goes a trap. I hit the I hit the Ooh, nice. No, don't hit me. Imagine if that, like, tapped me in the leg and I just fell over and died. Not the kettle! No! Oh, that was close. I'm not even going to bother going up to the other body and loot it. Nah. Okay, they were looking over here for some reason. What the heck were they aiming at? Nothing. Something! Hey, bear friend! Oh. Okay, I just took everything. <laughs> I love I love when the music kicks in, you're like, wait, what's going on? And then that happened. Okay, so there's Pine Watch. You're just passing it right now. Our house is just off of this. There's no road here. There's no road here, so we just go this way. Past uh, mud crab waters. Die, damn you. <laughs> Probably has an anger issue. Okay, past these waters. We've, in fact, passed through here before. It was uh, when we took care of that necromancer that was down here. So now there's this setup. We got a we got a anvil here. We have this table, beginner's ha guide to homesteading. We have a chest full of stuff. We got a drafting table so we can plan. There used to be trees here, but they chopped those down so that we could have some land to build our house in. Get get, get back here. Get get back here. There we go. Oh, look at the bird. Look at the bird. Bye bird. Okay. <laughs> Why'd that bird spawn another bird? Uh, 
Is the Necromancer back? Sure is. Constant problem, this guy. Oh, he's got bloodhounds. That's not good. Ow! Who hit me with that? Oh, he spawned a, spawned a flame actor next. I'm trapped. I'm stuck. I'm actually stuck. There goes that thing. Bone, bone dog still around. Bone meal, nice. Yeah, we're gonna have to constantly clear this guy out. He's gonna be annoying. The house is not safe. There will be things that will attack here randomly. Sometimes this guy respawns. Sometimes uh, uh, there's like a there's like a giant nearby. <laughs> there's, there's a giant that sometimes roams nearby and it's like, hey, I like your house. Can I attack it, please? And it'll attack it. Or like get real close and it'll, so it'll want to attack it elk up there okay so building this house let's see what materials we have all right drafting table we want to build the small house layout it's what we it's the only thing we have so if we look over here our plans are in motion this is where our small house is gonna go We need a foundation. We need 20 sawn logs and 10 quarried stone. This needs six sawn logs and 10 nails. I'll take this book. Yeah, 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 yeah. Space for the family, building materials. Uh huh, uh huh. There's a small house. We can make the main hall later on so we can expand upon our small house. Then we can add uh, wings to our house. We got bedrooms. We got a greenhouse. We have an enchanter's tower. We can only choose one of those. Uh, then the back area, we have a storage room. We have a trophy room. And we have a alchemy laboratory. Once again, only one of those. In the last area, we have an armory. We have a kitchen. And we have a library. Wait, I don't want to take this book. Okay, so I need to make quarried stone. You make quarried stone by finding areas that look like this and say mine stone quarry. Luckily, we have some stuff right already here. You can buy this some places, which will be very nice so that we don't have to continuously do this for minutes. Oh, that last, that last rotate, I didn't get anything from it. There's four. Although, unlike... Unlike, uh... Or veins. I think I could just stop doing anything, and I could I could like could walk away, and I'll just be continuously doing this until I'm either attacked or I'm carrying too much. Yeah, the stone's heavy. I have 31. They're each, they each weigh one pound. <laughs> I have 31 pounds of stone in my backpack. That should give us enough to build the foundation, though. Because of all the stuff in the chest, we have clay. Oh, it had quarried stone in there. We had clay, we had uh, whatever. Give me this. I need nails. I need to make nails. This acts as a full blacksmith thing. Uh, building materials. Nails. Iron ingots. That made 10 of them. Nice. We're just spending a lot of time in that menu. Get the walls framed. I need eight more nails. I build like two. This is building my smithing up, so thank God for that. Wait, 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 wait. Before I build that, look at this. The foundation's up. The wall supports are up. Let's make the walls now. Cool. Walls are up. No door yet. So I'm still over encumbered. Love it. Still over encumbered, so. Next, we need to work on the floor and the roof supports so I can actually have a ceiling above my head. I'll get there eventually. Hey, Raya, you want to hold more stuff? 
<laughs> Let's see. We can make the floor is quarried stone. Let's do that. Framing is on logs. We can do that. We can get the roof built. We can make the door. Oh, we can't make the door yet. Iron fittings, a lock, and two hinges. Iron fittings, lock, two hinges. I think it gave us just enough of material to make the house. Yeah, there we go. House is built. Well, the small house right now. Do I get a bleep blue for this? Hold on, I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put some stuff in here so I can at least go inside it. Uh, all of you go inside it. Oh, I'm just one pound light. Uh, store. There we go. It's not a manor yet. It'll get there. But now, now that I have the interior done, I have a workbench inside. So I could start building some containers to put in here, like dressers, end tables, barrels. I get some furniture. I can make a bed for some reason in this tiny area. I get some tables. I can get some shelves to put some stuff on. I have some wall sconces to give us some light. I have a fire pit I can make in here. I have a hanging rock, hanging rack, so I could like. That's where I could put some like pheasant or rabbit. Some more wall sconces. I need goat horns for this. But we want to build an expansion. We want to start working on the expansion. Plus, there's other stuff that we can build around here. Like you would have, you should have noticed a bunch of things popped up on this workbench. Like an animal pen, sawn log three. Oh, we have a garden. Also requires three sawn logs, I think. Or also just requires one. Just requires one. Yeah. Now I got an animal pen and a garden. So here's the garden. All I have to do is like find fertile soil and I could plant anything I want here. Like let's plant some blue mountain flowers. So now this will just continuously spawn blue mountain flowers for me. Did I accidentally put a cabbage there? I sure did. Well, let's put some purple here. I don't have enough purple to plant it everywhere. This one will be red. We'll get some dragon's tongues in the other spot. There we go. Over here is an animal pen. So, like, say I get a horse. I could put it right here. Like, you way up there. What the heck are you doing way up there? That is a horse, right? No, that's an elk. I didn't see the hooves or hooves. I didn't see the antlers. All right, let's start working on the next expansion then. What comes after this? I can remove the workbench inside if I don't want to build anything anymore for some reason. I can always just reinstall it. Let's start on the main hall. Got it all cordoned off. I can... <laughs> Let's see. We need to work on the foundation first, right? I have plenty of quarried stone. It's in my chest. Uh, iron fittings, lock, hinge, two nails. I don't think I have enough to make that. Iron fittings. I only have one sawn log now. Lock, two hinge, two nails. I don't have a lot for a lot. I need ironing it and corundiming it. E, so much for the door. I'm also missing nails. And I'm going to run out of sawn logs here soon. Hey, Rhea, how about you? Uh, I don't have anything. I don't have any chairs to make. Can I build a chair in here? I don't think I can. Furniture. Sawn log, four nails. Darn it! <laughs> Darn it! I don't, oh, she's tired. Well, I mean, I could have. I could head over to. Oh, it's snowing here. Lovely. 
I could head over to Valkyrie again. And now I have more things to go talk about to uh, the blacksmiths here. No dragon, no dragon, no dragon, no dragon. Hey, Lod. How are things? I hope you never found out I broke into your house. Steel's good, but loyalty's better. I'm loyal to Den Gear. Take a look. Let's see. You have some. I need some Krundabingits. Oh, anything to help me build stuff, huh? Didn't I buy something that I could, like, use? I guess I don't have it with me. Did I? What happened to it? I bought something that I could get enchanting for. I don't remember what I did with it. <laughs> uh, oh, give me, uh, give me the ore. Give me at my forge if you need I'm carrying too much again. Yes, my thing. Of course, thing. I haven't learned my lesson. Here. Give. Oh, she put it on. Give, give. Oh, which one did you just put on? Oh, these are all the good ones. These, these aren't the good, good ones. You know, it's fine. You can wear that. Lead on, then. Gives me some space. Uh, let's head over to Half Moon Hill. Because there was a logging camp thing here. That thing. Right there. We want sawn logs, huh? Let's go get some sawn logs. Hey, Hurt, how's things going? Is she gonna do the thing? Here for work. Get an axe and bring me all the wood you can chop. Hey, I like to buy some lumber. Doing some building, eh? We can deliver it wherever you need. Uh, I'll take 20 logs. I'll have them hold over right away. Thank you. Doing you know, I'm going to buy some more. I'll have them hold over doing some building, eh? I'll have them hold over. We're going to need a lot of doing logs. Some building, eh? I'll have them hold over right away. Doing some building, eh? I'll have them hold over right away. Thank you. All right, let's go back home. Luckily, we now have a fast travel point here. Did I just see a dragon off in the distance? It's a bird. Okay. <laughs> All our logs are getting are getting brought over here. We have 101 logs. We have some clay here if we want to make like some clay deposit stuff for future things. Uh, let's make that door now. Wait, what is that? I need to get this smelter ASAP. I need another iron fitting though. Uh, lock two nails. I thought I bought iron. What happened to my iron? Don't tell me about the ore. Don't tell me about the ore. About the ore. <sighs> oh no. Good to have you by my side, friend. I need reliable people around. You're welcome. Gotta love being everyone's friend. Darn it. That's why I said I need the smelter. So I have to fast travel the white run every time. I just want to make the door. I don't think I can make the foundation yet. Or else I might need a lot more refined uh, stone. I went to the wrong thing again. Oh, what did I need? Nails and a lock. This is all to make the door. Foundation. 30 quarried stone. I have plenty of those. Foundation. Let's get the floor done. 20 more. I need 11, 12 more nails. Leveled up my smithing. Nice. I'm glad I'm earning something for building this. No, I need more nails. I need way more nails. Stupid tiny nails.
What do we have so far? Oh boy. First level, second floor, uh, roof framing, second level walls. I need 25 nails. Oh, look at that thing. I will not have enough nails. That's fine. That's fine. I don't think I can put Raya inside yet, which kind of sucks. Because <laughs> we have we have nothing to build in here yet. Oh, this goes back out to Skyrim because it's not done yet. Uh, it's just an... I mean, look at it. Look at the, the framing right now. Goes back over here. This is a lot bigger than uh, Bree's home, huh? Got a second floor. Goes all the way around here. The yard, though. Oh, she's outside. She's outside the walls. All right. Hello. You know what? We need to we need to finish off the big part. Cause I don't want her to be on my team next episode. <laughs> Tundra Home said that's wrong. I hope it's still like afternoon. So I can talk with Adrienne here. I went to Dragon's Reach. What's the hurry? <laughs> what, what's the hurry? The episode's over an hour long, Raya. And she's probably wondering, like, what the heck is what the heck is Yambo talking about? He's doing weird thane things. Are you married? You look the part. Make sure you treat your wife with the respect she deserves. Do you change appearance when you're married? <laughs> also, thank you. I'm not married. You got some good Take a look. Okay, can I buy all of your armor? Your iron ingots, not ore. Don't forget to check in she only had she only had one ore, so I'm not I'm not too focused on buying it and turning it into things. <sighs> I don't know why I started making the bigger part of the house. Okay, I need twenty five nails. I'll make thirty. I mean, that was 40. House. Roof is done. Cellar's next. That wouldn't be bad. Oh, st uh, stop. 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 Oh, look. My flowers are done. <laughs> okay. So, I could do this. I could uh, remodel house in the entryway. There. What do I have to do for this? Nothing. It's already done. Okay, so my small house, which was this part, uh, now that I have the big parts, uh, this is now just like a foyer. A foyer. So the workbench stuff there is going to be different. But this is now open up. And there should be a workbench around here now. There we go. Look at that. It even comes with some food. And some lights. This place is going to look nice. I need a bed. I don't have beds here. Beds are upstairs. Oh, I can't make the bed. I don't have enough straw or leather. Weapon plaques. Lots of bookshelves. Uh, and then like chandelier stuff and trophy mount things. This is where I think the master bed goes, right here. This is another bedroom over here. Where I think the two single beds go. This has... Oh, look at that. Oh, look at this. Let me make that cellar quickly, and then we'll call it. Just so I have three layers of house. <laughs> Furniture, end tables, weapon racks, shelves, exterior. 
lots of stuff. This chest right here is going to become my best friend. This is where I'm going to start putting everything I don't want right now. <laughs> Breeze Home is now going to become like our home. This is going to become our main home for now. Until we get the Tundra Homestead, I think that's going to become like our main, main home. Somewhere we're going to be staying and we're going to be putting like everything in. Tundra Homestead might actually be it because there's a... There's a blacksmithing thing already there. It's just super expensive, and it's already furnished. And it's also a creation club thing. There's also there's other houses that we can find, too, that are already, like, pre-built and pre-furnished. I think the uh, the dinner one that we have to go to is one of them. I'm going to be over-encumbered here again. That's fine. I just need enough to get me, like, 50. Building a house is hard and then and expensive. It's very expensive. Especially if you want to get everything in the house. Because there's stuff in here. Because you're all of a sudden going to be like, I should have picked up all of these pelts I've been missing out on. It really eats at you after that. There's the there's the cellar. There's the stable. Four cord stone, two iron fittings. Can I make that? Darn it, darn it, darn it, darn it, darn it, darn it. I know you're tired. But I get this smelter and I don't have to worry anymore. No more fast travels to Whiterun just to smelt stuff. I think this backpack would help me carry more. <laughs> Imagine if my inventory was only limited to things pre-backpack. Okay, so we got an armor workbench now, so I can make things better. Here's my smelter, and uh, there's the stable for my horses. I actually don't know what go here. <laughs> I don't know what goes here. There's a tanning rack right here. Any any giants here? No, good, good. All right. That's gonna do it for this episode. Ah, oh, I got a house. I got a house. I'm Thane of Falkreath. We killed those guards. We got some orcish armor. Give me that yes, back. Yes, my Thane. Do you need something? I need a steward for my house. Are you interested? I'd be honored to be your steward. You've built a fine steading here. Thank you. Wait, you just left a... Oh. Oh? I didn't know I could do this. Oh. Hey. Uh, you know I could buy materials like glass or straw? Hmm. You might try gray pine goods in Falkreath. They carry all sorts of things like that. Oh, okay. Hey. Lead on, Thane. My blade is always yours to command. I'm still here. Give me your Of course, give, Thane. Give me the How things can I from be of service? Take. Take. Take, take, take. I'll take that iron arrow. I'll keep watch at Lakeview Manor until you return, Thane. Good hunting. Whew, okay. She's here now. Good. I have Lydia watching over Breeze Home, and I got Raya watching over Lakeview Manor. I think I think Raya's got the better end of this better end of the deal, but I mean, at the moment, there's nothing here. <laughs> there's nothing here for her. I'm just gonna put these in here for now. All right. Well, she's gonna. Where is she gonna sit? Honor to you. I made I made you a table here for you to sit. Sit here. Ooh, an apple dumpling. I can't wait to make everything and then clear everything off the tables. Get rid of all the clutter. <sighs> That's gonna do it for this episode. Uh, on the next episode of Skyrim, God, what are we gonna do? We still have all the books to go get in Falkreath, but I might want to leave there for now. Oh, she's just she's just hanging out up there. Can we be Thane of another place yet? Uh, I don't think so. Maybe we, uh, I have no idea what we're going to do next episode. <laughs> so until next time, hopefully you enjoy.